The Wise Channel celebrates African Americans who did amazing things. What are you doing? I'm pretending to be an astronaut flying through space. You sound a lot like Mae Jemison. You're right. She knew that she wanted to be an astronaut when she was a kid. But she didn't just dream about it. Mae Jemison was so smart, she went to college when she was 16 years old. Then she graduated from Stanford University with two degrees. She was only two degrees? I thought humans were supposed to be 98.6 degrees. Her temperature wasn't two degrees. She earned two degrees at college. Two degrees? Mae Jemison is sure one cold sister. Anyway, after college, she went to a medical school at Cornell University, trained in Cuba and Thailand, and help sick people in Sierra Leone, Africa. It's hot over there. I bet you got 100 degrees in Africa. <laughs> Dr. Mae Jemison also did research to help make vaccines. That reminds me. I need to take my flu shot this year. Dr. May moved to Los Angeles where she worked as a doctor and took even more classes at college. I guess she wanted another degree. I told you, we need at least 98 degrees. With all of her success on Earth, Dr. May was ready to chase her dream of going to space. She applied to NASA and eventually was selected to go on a space mission. On September 12, 1992, Dr. Mae Jemison became the first African-American woman in space. That's pretty important. Right, because a lot of people thought being an astronaut was just for white men. Since Dr. Mae was a woman and African-American, she overcame a lot of challenges getting to space. While she was there, she did important science experiments to help people on Earth. After her mission in space, Dr. May became a professor and helped students of all ages learn more about science. Today, she is an author, speaker, and a leading voice encouraging students of all races to learn more about science. In other words, Dr. May Jemison is one cold sister. And she proved it doesn't matter whether you're a man, woman, black, white, or any other race, we can all reach for the stars. Let's talk. How did Dr. Mae Jemison use science to help others? How can you use what you learn to help others? If you could be the first to do something, what would it be? Have you subscribed to the WISE channel yet? If not, do it today so you don't miss out. Have a great day. Bye.